moral progress occurs when a person does not simply accept the commandments of an outer or inner authority as a motive for action, but tries to understand the reason why a particular principle of conduct should motivate him. This is to advance from morality based on authority to conduct based on moral insight. At this level of morality, a person will consider the needs of a moral life and will let this knowledge determine his actions. Such needs are, one, the greatest possible good of all humanity purely for its own sake, two, the progress of culture or the moral development of humanity to ever greater perfection, and three, the realization of individual moral goals that have been grasped by pure intuition. This video is about the first two, the common good and cultural progress. The next video is about individual moral goals based on pure intuition. The greatest possible good of all humanity will naturally be understood in different ways by different people. This principle does not refer to any specific idea of this good, but rather it means that each individual who acknowledges this principle will strive to do whatever in his opinion best promotes the good of all humanity. For the person who takes pleasure in the benefits of culture, the progress of culture is seen to be a special application of the ethical principle of greatest possible good. However, he will have to accept as the price of progress the decline and destruction of many things that also contribute to the common good. It is also possible for someone to see a moral necessity in the progress of culture, apart from any feeling of pleasure that culture brings. In that case, the progress of culture is for him an ethical principle of its own, in addition to the principle of the common good.